Hey, Pax. Good afternoon, everyone. I'm hanging out with Paxton, the prairie dog. Poppy is somewhere around. Pax dragged his little yarn along with him. His fur is coming in real nice. Look at those little tea furs. Good boy, he's just relaxing. We went to the vet the other day and they said he is doing so well. Hey bud. Do you want some greens? Look at that. Whoop, okay. Where are we going? Here you go. He knows this is a snack box. Poppy taught him. Paxton. This is a hanging bed. He stole some of my shorts and stuffed them in there. Here you go. So he's going to be busy working out here. Where is Poppy? I think she's taking a nap. Yep, she's a little potato. Hey, Poppy. It's so early. Too early for nap time. Let's see. Come on. There we go. Hi. Good morning. Look at that pretty smile. Hi. Do you want some basil? Look at those teeth. What a smile. Hi. You want some basil? Thoughts? No? Yes? No? Okay. Hey, HP. Everyone is great. Paxton's uh, playing with a little snuffle ball over there. Poppy is busy being Poppy. She just woke up from a nap. I kind of woke her up. It's a little early to be napping. We need to get her moving. Moving around, exercising, hanging out. Pax is a busy boy, yes. Does Poppy bite? Um, she has, she can. Oh, what a big stretch. Hi. Do prairie dogs use hamster wheels? They actually have this in here. This is actually, uh, it's called a chin spin. And it's kind of like a hamster wheel. It's a little more quiet. It's a little better for their backs. Um, when she was a baby, this is actually what she used. Now she just uses it to kind of keep her teeth in check. How much weight does Poppy need to lose? So she was uh, 
just over one kilo. Now she's 1.28 kilos. So ideal weight is about 1.15. So not too much, but a good amount. Hey bud, look at that little snuffle ball. Pax is playing with his little snuffle ball. Mm-hmm. Hi, baby. Want a little basil? No. She said, I want snacks. Or else. Here. Diet snacks. Oh, there we go. Do they use litter boxes? No. Um, they do have two little areas though that they use to go potty. Yeah, I'm poppy. Some fresh basil from the garden. That's it. Is that good? You wanna do a big stretch? Stretch it out. Big stretch. Kisses. Aww, that's so nice, Poppy. No, oh, now they're ganging up to get into the snack box. Have we tried playing music for them? Uh, yeah, Breen listens to music in the background when she's working in here usually. And I think they like pretty much anything except for the intense parts of the Harry Potter soundtrack. <laughs> Tough luck. Yes, Pax is doing really well, looking great. Fur is growing in really well. You can see it's coming in really nice, blending in. I just need some Rogaine or something for his little, his little head. He's got a little bald spot. Hey, Poppy. What is the background on Paxton? He, uh, his previous owner allowed an infection to go a little, a little too long. She was neglecting him. Uh, so the infection got so bad that he ended up having to have his arm amputated. How old are the doggies? Poppy is three and a half going on four in April. 
Um, and PAX is going to be 7 in April. Hi, Poppy. Hi. Thanks, China doll. Ooh. What was that? Poppy wants snacks. Did she hit past him? Or you? No, me. Oh, well, that makes sense. Mm -hmm. What is their normal lifespan? Um, in captivity, it is three to five years, and in captivity, wait, in the wild, it's three to five years, in captivity, it's eight to 12. Uh, we know of a lot of other prairie dogs who are actually beyond the 12 year mark and still doing really well. Um, not sure about an artificial leg yet. Pax is doing really well without one, so. So we'll see, we take it day by day. Poppy. Here we go, Andy's off. Do they get their teeth cleaned? Uh, they get wellness checks every six months and just make sure everything's in order. Their teeth are constantly growing, so um, so there's really no need to, to brush their teeth or anything. Does Poppy pick on Paxton? Uh, she was for a little while now. Now they're a lot better in getting along, sharing, kind of. Poppy still tries to get as many snacks as possible. Hey, bud. When's Pax and Poppy's birthday? I'm not sure the exact day, but we say April 1st. Does Pax like to be held like Poppy? He does. He likes little tummy rubs, too. Do we give white corn on the cob? We uh, go to the farmer's market and and we get corn and um, cook it a little bit every morning, warm it up. Is Poppy still on a diet? Yes. HP power, April 1st for both. Uh, April 1st for Poppy. Still not sure about Paxton yet. Not sure if we want to do a joint birthday for them or what? What well, do you Poppy think? Poppy told me, she said she wants her own birthday party. Oh, okay. And then she wants, um, she'll have one with Paxton. Okay. So, so Poppy gets two birthdays exactly. and Paxton gets to share one. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's what she said. But Pax is okay with that. What is this animal? A uh, prairie dog. Did they get weight at the vet? Yes. Uh, Pax is doing great. He's one kilo or about 2.2 .2 pounds. And Poppy is 1.28 kilos. So she's a little bit, a little bit hefty. She needs to, to lose a little bit of weight. She's been eating Paxton's portions of snacks. <laughs> Do they have accidents outside of the cage? Not really. I mean, they will poop every once in a while. A little poop will shoot out of their butt, but uh, peeing, they, they really confine it to one, one spot.
Pex is, yeah, Pex is uh, walking great, running great, getting up and down the ramps really well. He's, he's, uh, he's doing surprisingly well. Yeah, everyone does love to ask about bathroom habits for sure. Thanks, Becky. Yeah, everyone hit that like button. Sao Paulo, Brazil. Hello. Where is everyone else from? I know a lot of people are from the US, but everywhere else in the world too. Pax loves this little snuffle mat. And where is Poppy? She's busy doing who knows what under there. <clears throat> Germany, India, Brazil, Russia, Minnesota, Wyoming, Texas, Chile, London. Wow, everywhere. South Africa, Netherlands, Sweden. Tennessee, Germany, Poland. How did we get Poppy to Wahoo when we say her name? It's just a natural reaction, actually. Um, they do it out of happiness, or uh, it's also just a sign of camaraderie. What breed of prairie dog are they? These are black-tailed prairie dogs. Spain, Ohio. Daytona Beach, hello. Brooklyn, New York. Do we recommend adopting or getting a prairie dog? We do not. Uh, they're incredibly destructive. They. Uh, require constant time and attention. They can become very aggressive. Pex, here's the snack bag. Hold on, bud. Uh, let's see. Let me do this. I can use both hands. So you can see how well he is getting along with, with only one hand here. Doing the same little chonky squat that Poppy does when she eats. Oh, but anyway, yes, uh, prairie dogs are not good pets. Uh, require constant time and attention, destructive. Um, they require special care also. Uh, so you, if, if you don't have a vet that knows about small animals or exotics, um, that's also a huge factor. We have to drive about 45 minutes in order to, to get to a vet. Hey bud, that's it, I don't have any more. Are they most active during the day or night? Uh, during the day. Does Dr. K still see them? She does. Uh, yeah, Dr. K and her team. Hey, bud. Hi. All right, well, I am going to get some lunch, so we'll leave these two hanging out and playing, and maybe we'll see you all a little later.
Have a great day, everyone. Pex is making his little chatter noise. I don't know if you can hear it. Oh, he's done. All right. Have a good day.